This is Steve Montgomery at Unheard of Guitar, and this is D Cause number four. I'm not going to call this anti cult because the word cult is a term that conjures up all kinds of misunderstandings and really it, it actually has too many meanings to mean anything of, of value at this moment or what I'm trying to communicate. But it is clear that there are numerous groups that would be something like this. Destructive, thought reforming groups that use undue influence to gain adherence and to keep them. And so the word indoctrination could get thrown in there. Um, but uh, the word cult is, it makes you think of TV shows and movies and, and uh, people that maybe uh, are zombies and also uh, people that are hypercritical of stuff that they don't agree with. So what I'm referring to as a thought reforming destructive group um, isolates people and this is what they do they take you away from yourself that's the kind of isolation I'm talking about and reshape you in the image of what they would prefer you to be for whatever goals they have in mind whether it's monetary just a desire for power which power breeds more power as we know um, but one of the key things I can tell you is that in understanding this sort of stuff, it's really, really not what the person believes. That's not the part that's, that's going to be in contention. The part that matters is how they became, became uh, true believers, how they came about to uh, get this set of beliefs. That's where manipulation, deception, and control of information and uh, control of the human being, uh, reshaping them, as I said, which doesn't require beatings, drugs, uh, or e verbal intimidation. It can be so peaceful and so wonderful that many of these groups come across as they can really cause change. People get off drugs. People seem to be at peace at one in some groups. Um, groups can be political. They can be psychologically based. They can be uh, Eastern meditative based. They can be uh, Christian biblically based. Uh, but again, it really doesn't matter what the set of beliefs are that defines destructive. The way I'm talking about it is how did you come about to gain those beliefs? That's the part that uh, people would uh, need assistance uh, to get out of. Or if they didn't get assistance, time, reflection, thought, separation from the group that they're under undue influence from, um, those sorts of things. So uh, yeah, that's a big can of worms. Um, psychologist, uh, legal uh, precedent, uh, all of these, uh, uh, all of these things don't necessarily stand on the side of what is correct, but there are experts out there who truly understand this phenomenon. Um, and I think that's probably it, but deception, control of information, control of your environment, uh, these, are, these are some of the big, big um, elements, and there's others, that will lead a person to truly no longer be themselves, just hidden away inside uh, the shell created by uh, a destructive group. So that is it for because number four.
Adiós.